This is a distinctly different take on Loser. It's a Grateful Dead song, but this one features Betty LeVette, Detroit's own Betty LeVette, and Grateful Dead co-founder Bob Weir on a new album called Grateful Dedication. Detroit's own Dave McMurray has this new collection of songs, and he is joining us live to talk about the album. First of all, good morning, Dave. How you doing? Been a minute, man. You all right? Uh yeah, hanging in here. How you doing, Lee? Uh, I am doing well. It's great to see you. And great to see you still at your thing, man. And you do it well. You play with uh, so many of the greats. You make beautiful music. So I'm glad to see you. you. Not only here in Detroit, I'm looking at that uh, I'm looking at that uh, video. Did you shoot that here too? It was I did it in Detroit and New York. <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah. That was a good that job. Was fun. That was a good uh, job, man. Oh, thank you. Let's talk about the album first, though. What 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 got you the idea to do uh, the Grateful Dead songbook? Well, you know, I, it's funny. I I I wasn't like a long time deadhead, mm -hmm. but I've been. You know, I I do the hits, of course. But a, a few years back, I got a chance to uh, do one of the many Don Was aggregations, and this was like a Was and That Was offshoot, yeah. and it was featuring Bob Bob Weir. And we did one of his songs, and when I saw the chart, it was just like uh, all these odd measures and great chord changes. And when we did the song live, it was hypnotic. It was a big festival, and I looked out, and all these people were, in, were into it. And I was like, let me try to investigate their catalog. So I just started trying to listen to what they were doing and everything. And then in Detroit, I got a chance to sit in with the Wolf Brothers, mm -hmm. which was which is. Uh, Bob Weir with Don Woods, mm -hmm. and uh, we did a few songs, and and I had to go to YouTube to go get into their catalog, and it was just such a great time. So I was like, let me just investigate the catalog and see what I can do. And so I went in, recorded one song, one led to two, and then pretty soon, you know, a whole album of it. Dave, man, this is a whole different kind of flavor. I, I'm not a deadhead myself, but I'm into it. I, I was listening to oh, cool. as much as I could before this interview. I'm like, man, he turned me on to something sweet. I got to ask you something, man. You've played with the Stones, Gladys Knight. I mean, I could go on. The list the list is prestigious. Uh, what's the what's the one phone call you got and you're like, what? Who just call, Who just asked me to play with them? Well, I mean, I gotta say, my my best hang was with the Rolling Stones. You there know? you go. That was the, that was that was a it was a shocker. And when I went, it happened just like he said. He said, if you come to California, when you meet Keith, he's gonna ask you to play. I mean, you know, he's gonna you're gonna play. So I went to California, and it happened exactly like he said. You know, with, as soon as he walked in the room, he's like, "Is that a saxophone? Feel like playing?" <laughs> I was like, "Yeah." And it's and. But I got to hang out with him for like three days, and that was definitely a hang. You know, I was just kind of yeah. like a fly on the wall, trying to be, you know, inconspicuous. You know, <laughs> but it was just like, I mean, cause, but at three in the morning, they would be raging. Wow, it just man. Be, it was great. So that that was like the coolest hang, you know. Yeah, I like the way you put it, the coolest hang, baby. Real quickly, we've got 30 seconds left, Dave. What do you want people to know about the, about the album? Well, grateful dedication. I, it's got it's a different take. It's kind of like my uh, take to San Francisco by way of Detroit. There you, you know, go. Because it's definitely got the it's definitely got the Detroit flavor. And to let you know that I'm gonna be doing a, a record release party at the L Club on Sunday. Yep. At doors open at seven. Show starts at eight. Yeah. Come through. You'll have a good time. I guarantee. You. Uh, always a good time with you, Dave. You put your heart into your music, my man. I appreciate you coming on this morning, and I'll give them the information one more time. Sunday, seven o'clock, the L Club. You see, it's right there on Verner in Detroit. You want more oh, yeah. information? Lclubdetroit.com, and the album is available through Blue Note. Am I right, Dave? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yes. Yeah. On all, all digital outlets, anywhere. Anywhere yeah, yeah. you can get it. All right, Dave. Keep doing what you're doing. I appreciate talking to you, man. Yeah, good talking to you, Lee. All okay, right. thanks. All right. Now let's move on into celebration.